I'll be showing you step by step how to set up and customize an image banner on your Shopify DOM theme. Let's start things off from our Shopify dashboard. And to go and customize our DOM theme, let's head to online store on the left hand side menu. It should open up the Shopify theme section automatically. And we can see our currently installed version of DOM. And I'm going to hit customize here to bring us to the Shopify theme editor. And my homepage is going to load automatically here. And as you can see, I really don't have much here. And I want to add an image banner to make my store look much more professional. So to do so, I'll head to the left hand side menu. Under the template section, I'll click add section. And from here, I'm going to select the image banner. There's also to do an image with text, but for now, I'll keep it as image banner here as it makes the text very readable. So if I click on it, I get some settings on the right hand side and I can go and edit each individual section by clicking on it in the sub menu right here. So first off, let's go and design my images. For the first image, we can either explore or select a image I've already uploaded. You can also add new images here if you would like. I've uploaded this in a past video, so I'm gonna use these orange poles here. Now for my second image, I'm going to go to explore free images here and use one of Shopify's provided free images. I like the looks of this one. And that's gonna give me a dual image background here. Now, if you just want one or the other, I could potentially just remove this one and set it to be the full image. It's up to you on how you want that to look. Next up, we can change our image overlay opacity. So this is gonna be on our background image here. We can basically set the opacity or how see-through it is here. So the darker percentage it gets, the harder it is to see this image until it's completely black. And you might wanna do this to make the text easier to read. Next up, we can set the banner height. You can test out changing it. I think medium is pretty good as it's not going to take up too much of the section here while still showing the image. Next up, we can customize the container on desktop Top, and this is the background here to make our text a little easier to read. What I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this container as what I'll do next is change the color of the text here to make it stand out more. And with a high image opacity, it's going to really be easily readable. And we can do this with the color scheme. So I can go and edit this color scheme by clicking on it. And I'm going to change the text to white. Actually, now that I do that, I realize that many things use this color one scheme here. So I'm going to head to settings on the left hand side, head to colors. I'll add a new color scheme and I'll set the text to white and the button I want to be red with a white text on top. So let's head back to my homepage, click on image banner head to the right hand side and I can change this color scheme to the brand new one I just created. If you've made any sales on your Shopify store, you know how hard it is to keep track of how much money your store has actually made. You have your revenue, your cost goods sold, transaction fees, all your ad spend, as well as any other monthly expenses. It can be a headache to keep track of. And that's where our sponsor Profit Calc comes in, the one-click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. It syncs seamlessly, and all you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real-time calculations, so you can see how much money your store has actually made. It works seamlessly with all your different ad accounts from Facebook, Google, Snapchat, Bing, Pinterest, and TikTok, as well as many cost of goods sold providers. There's a 15 day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself so you can start making smarter business decisions as you'll have a true understanding of your store's performance. There's a link in the description that will take you to the Shopify app store directly. You can also search for it by searching for Profit Calc and then looking for this logo in the top left left here. Again, there's a 15 day free trial. So make sure you check that out. I can see my text is standing out nicely. Next up, I can add some animations to the image behavior. So I could put some ambient movement, but I'll just leave this as none here. But it's up to you if you want this animation. In terms of the layout, I'm just gonna leave this at center. I can also stack multiple images on mobile. And if I can preview this by clicking the mobile icon at the top, and if I do have the container, it's going to separate it between an image and the container, but I want this to overlay nicely. So I'm going to turn this setting off. Next up, let's go and customize the individual elements of our banner. So I'll click on image banner and the text underneath and I can customize the text once I click on this on the right hand side. So I could say, welcome this camping store. I can set the heading size to large here, small or medium. I'll leave it as medium and I'll say check out our latest products. And I'll set this to an uppercase and for the buttons, I can then select certain links on our page. And once we enter in the link, it's going to actually fill out the button color here. I'm just going to select to go to these two products. I'll set one as an outline and one as a regular. Next up, I want to move this to the top of my page. So on the left hand side sub menu, 
I hover over image banners, I can see six dots here. And I can drag this to the top section, making it the top element of my page. To finalize these changes, let's hit save in the top right. And if I check out the live URL of my store, I can see I have a new image banner for my Shopify store here with two buttons. I did not customize the text here. I can actually do so by going back to it, clicking on the button label and saying shop our latest and shop our best sellers. Now it's gonna be up to you what you wanna put in there, but just like that, we've added an image banner to our store. It's super easy to do with the Shopify Dawn theme. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I would love it so much if you smash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.